Hi guys, look Fog here and welcome to FIFA 19 player review and today I'm going to be reviewing the 92 rated prime icon Rivaldo. He has got one hell of a good looking card and he did cost me in the region of 10,000 coins to complete his loan SPC and in the four games that I played him with he scored me one goal and got me one assist and he does have a two star big force as well as four star skill moves. Then moving along into his in-game stats, his main standout stats are going to be his 91 attack positioning, his 89 short passing, his 94 ball control. And finally, his 92 volleys. And I did have the finisher chemistry down applied to Rivaldo. And I actually did review his 90 rated card a few weeks ago. And I recommend you guys to go and do the SPC. I was um, very surprised by it, actually, because I don't think, obviously, because that two stoic foot put me off him, to be quite honest, initially using him. But still, I went ahead and reviewed him. And actually, I thought he was a pretty decent icon to go for. So I thought I'd do this lone SPC for the prime one and see how he compares, essentially, to the 90 rated card. And I have to say, I'm left disappointed, unfortunately. Unfortunately, um, the, the only real reason I can think of it, the card didn't feel that bad for the most part. It's just, I think he's wasted in, a, in, in an out wide position and he suits being played much more in a central role like a cam position, not not on the left hand side at all. There's so many other better left wings that you can go for for such a cheaper price in both icons and just regular players and ultimate team that are better to go for than this Rivaldo card at the uh, left hand side. But uh, anyway, he's still got some good parts to his card. His first pro is actually going to be his dribbling. Absolutely fantastic drilling. 90 agility, 93 reactions, 94 ball control as well, and some other very decent stats he does have. 77 balance isn't the best, but you don't notice that too much in-game. I wouldn't let that put you off uh, whatsoever. I thought his drilling was brilliant. And obviously, because I believe this is the slowest pace of all the Rivaldas, I'm pretty certain in that. Um, you know, he does kind of have to rely a little bit more on his dribbling being better as a kind of means of being able to kind of take on defenders and be able to beat them and stuff like that. And he's more than capable of being able to do that. So uh, definitely dribbling. 100% still a really good part to the card and uh, one that has to be put down as a big pro to him. His second pro is actually going to be his passing. Now, one assist in four games isn't a good return and I'll be quite honest, I wasn't happy with that whatsoever. Having said that, he still provided countless amounts of chances for my other players in game and obviously I'm going through a little, a little bit of a team transition at the moment and having to switch from uh, Icon Crespo to Inform Suarez was a little bit difficult and I'm still finding that transition a little bit difficult. So, Rivaldo was providing good chances to the likes of Suarez, for example, and uh, just wasn't uh, quite find in the back of the net Suarez on all occasions but um, even so I actually really did enjoy his passing, his passing stats are very good as well 89 crossing in particular I did enjoy as well as his 88 vision and uh, that is going to be another pro to his card, there's no more other pros to him and there's actually no cons to him at the same time but for me he did, there just seemed to be something off with this card Um I, I really don't know what and the only thing I can think of is that he just doesn't suit being played out wide and I don't like him in an out wide position I really really don't like him uh, to the point that I'd rather probably have the 85 rated inform Martial playing out wide than this Rivaldo card and I'm not joking by that Martial inform is a better wing player than Rivaldo he just doesn't suit this position whatsoever he does lack a little bit in pace and you do notice that as well his stamina and all fairness at 85 is fine uh, his shooting stats look great but didn't feel fantastic in game only one goal from the four games was uh, again disappointing to be quite honest he has to be played in the central role and I recommend buying Rivaldo I just don't recommend buying this 92 rated card I think the SBC is a little bit too much it's kind of fair in the fact that it's only an 85 rated team they have to submit but still you've got to go and buy an icon I think that's still a little bit too much for Rivaldo because don't get me wrong this card's very good but there are a lot of areas to him as well that he just lacks in good stats you know the balance for example the two star weak foot and stuff like that uh, his work rates aren't necessarily the best at medium low as well the fact that he's a preferred foot at the left you know it, it, it's just there's just something about him that I, I really didn't like and it and it, for me, it mainly comes down to positioning. I've got to be quite honest. And I just think there's better icons to go for and, and, and better players in FIFA, you know, like Eden Hazard, like the inform Martial, just better wingers than this Rivaldo card, to be quite honest. And uh, in my honest opinion, I'd stay clear of this icon card. We're going to see a lot more icons uh, as Footmas continues on anyway, and we're going to see better ones than this Rivaldo. And to be quite honest, I'd probably rather have Pavel Nedved as well than uh, Rivaldo. But um, yeah, just not an icon that I didn't, really seemed it just didn't seem to click with me and I'm disappointed because I was really looking forward to using this one to see how he'd compare to the 90 and I was expecting good things from him and he's not the worst icon in the world you know, he's not he's not terrible at the same time but do you want to be paying over a million coins for him no the answer is you don't want to be uh for someone's got a two-star week foot and you're considering paying a million coins for him it's just not worth it guys it really isn't but uh, anyway guys that's gonna finish up this play thank you very much for watching and I'll see you guys later